Let me show you the fastest and easiest way to record your iPhone screen without downloading any apps. It's built into every single iPhone. First, you need to activate this option. Go to the settings menu on your iPhone and you want to go to control center. That's just a little bit down under general here. And right here, there's a bunch of things under control center. And I'm going to remove one just to show you. By default, the screen recording option won't show up on this section called included controls. It will be down here under more controls. So all you have to do is find something called screen recording. And if you press the plus sign, it's going to add it to our control center. And then we could grab these three lines and bring it all the way to the top if we want this to be the very first thing we see under the control center. So yours should look like this and you could exit the settings page. Now, let me exit this page altogether and to access our control center on iPhones after iPhone 10 is right up here. You just come down right here and on older iPhones it's just from the bottom of the page. So I'm going to go over here and as long as you added it, and you moved it to the top, it's gonna to show up right over here. Now, let me show you before you press on this icon. If you press and hold on it, you could actually turn on your microphone. So let's say you were doing a screen demonstration like I'm doing here, you would want to turn on your microphone and that will turn on your microphone here. And I do always use an external little microphone that sounds a lot better. So I'll link that in the description as well. And you wanna make sure your screen recording is going to your photos. Okay, so now we're all set. Now I could just tap it. It's gonna give me a countdown from three. And as soon as it's done, my screen is getting recorded and you'll see this recording icon right up here now. Anytime once you start doing your screen recording and you wanna finish it, just press this red option right here and it's gonna let you stop it from this page. I'm gonna press stop. And to find this recording is saved to my photos app. So I'll go to my photos app here and it's the last one and this is the screen recording. And from here you could press edit if you want to take out the beginning part, for example, the part where I'm actually showing the control center and the end part is basically the part I said stop. I could go ahead and trim that and press done and save it as a new video. And then I could share it from here on text message or on email. I hope you found this quick video useful and I'll see you next time.